Noah, I'm sorry, bro. Hey, man. It worked out better for me anyway. The swimmies in summertime from the class weren't next to nothing. Bro, it's okay to be mad. Hey, why should I be mad? Hey, why should you just left me out there at the bus stop or something? As soon as I wouldn't spend money on this stupid bus card. Could I have done something? Hey, man, you ain't gotta do nothing, Joy. I shot my shot, I got pretty damn close, didn't I? Yeah, I looked at the gram, I seen her green light on. I'm like 14! Her Instagram post in a row. She never even opened my DM. Tell her! I don't see one, man. I love Wayne there. Alright, man. This this video is going is gonna be, you know, it's gonna hit home. You know, for every man out there. This video gonna hit home. It's about bad dating experiences, man. I'm just gonna talk about what my three worst dating experiences would be. You know what I mean? And in order. So number one, we looking at number one being the worst. Gotta be being stood up, man. That is dead, man. When you you gonna tell me you wanna date? You wanna tell me you wanna go out and then you don't show up? And I got the fresh fit on. I got the hairline done and all that. I step off the city bus and you know where we found. That's dead. Number two, man. Bad hygiene. When the hygiene is bad, that's got to be number two. Or breath stink. You know what I'm saying? The pits smell like some... The pits... Or your, your body, you stink. Okay? That's got to be number two. And number three is the... You know what I'm saying? Is being catfish. That's bad, yo. So I'm gonna break each one of these down. So being catfish, this, this is this is sketchy. You know, I've been catfished before, like on a messaging app. Back when I was a young boy, I was texting this one girl from um, Cali, and and she was using Zendaya's pictures. <laughs> she was using Zendaya's pics. So obviously, I'm like, damn, like she's nice. Oh, she talking all crazy shit to me, telling me send send her pictures of, of my freaking. I can't say that on YouTube, but she was trying to get me to send to send them pics, and I was and I wasn't with it because I was a young boy, you know. I was a little, I wasn't really developed back then. I was in middle school. <laughs> she 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 betrayed me. She had me thinking I was talking to Zendaya, and then I cross referenced the pic, shorty. You a snake. You broke my heart. <laughs> if you're watching this, it's me. God damn. It's Noah Agu from Kick, you know what I'm saying? I hate you. But anyway, <laughs> you catfish me. You gotta be a crazy mother to catfish somebody. And, and you show up at the date and you're not who you say you are? I'm sorry, but I'm leaving. And you're going to be sick because you're going to have to either wash some dishes in the back or you're going to have to pay. Because I'm not going to sit there and, and humiliate myself with a complete stranger. You could be a man. You know what I mean? Trying to get at me with these Zendaya pictures and I'm falling for it. That's a damn shame, yo. Watch it back out here, man. Catfish is real. And they out here and they scheming. So number two is the hygiene. Yo. Showing up to a date. It was one time I had a girl. I did a little home date thing. Had a girl come over to my crib. And she smelled like, yo. <laughs> she smelled like new pie. You get me? Bro. She came over to the crib. She smelled like fish sticks. She smelled like fish fillet. You heard? <laughs> fish fillet. Filet mignon. Straight like that. <laughs> She came over there smelling crazy, and I ain't even peeked because I liked her so much. I'm just looking at how good she looked. I'm like, damn, this girl fine. Mind you, the whole time, she smelled like Dory from Finding Nemo. You know what I'm saying? I can't get her up out of there, man. Straight like that. So don't come to the dinner date smelling like... Don't come over smelling crazy. You better take a shower. You better get in that shower. You better touch that hot water. Now, number one, as you've seen in the in the film, in the short film I, I just showed y'all, being stood up got to be the most embarrassing, worst feeling ever. Come on, man. You just going to not show up? I get on the bus to come see you. Girl, you tripping. 
It's cold out there. I got homeless people asking me, what's the occasion? Like, I remember the one time I, want, I wanted to meet a girl at the movies. This is back when I didn't have no phone or a car. So basically, I had to hit her up on the gram. I slid in her DM. I said, yo, would you like to go to the movies? She, these girls are so corny. She said, yes, I would love to go. I said, all right, cool. I'm going to be there at boom, boom, boom time, 7 o'clock. You know what I mean? I'll be waiting for you out front of the, the gym. I'm there 30 minutes early to make sure that she don't see me get off the bus. I'm there 30 minutes early. I'm sitting outside the, the freaking movie theater. I catch the bus. I get off the bus a mile away from the movie theater so that she don't see me walking onto the property off the city bus. You know what I mean? In the hood to get a cut. I walk down. Boom. I'm in the front of the movie theater. I'm waiting. Waiting, waiting, waiting. It's it's seven. It's seven fifteen. I'm like, okay, she might just be. She might just be running a little late. So I asked somebody, "Yo, can I borrow your phone so I can um, text my text my date?" They let me use a phone, so I get on the gram. I DM her, "Yo, I'm here. Where you at?" Seen. Yo, you know I mean I DM her the little eye emoji. Seen. Another eye emoji. Seen. At this point, I'm a clown. <laughs> I, 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 you can put a red note, clown me. You got too many women out here making us, making us men clowns. Okay, I'm sitting here. Hey, maybe her phone just broke. Maybe, maybe she not really reading this. It's just, nah, man. I'm lying to myself so that I don't, I don't feel bad. I caught three buses to get there, man. I caught three buses just to see you, and you ain't even gonna show up. Yeah, all right, that's what we doing. I was sick that day. Don't get yo, don't get stood up. Don't be a clown. If she don't respond to the DM, matter of fact, if you don't see her verbally say I'm going, don't even go. You know what I mean? The moment you get on that bus, <laughs> you a clown, dog. You a clown, and I'm a clown too. Damn, man. But yeah, don't get stood up out here, man. Um, being stood up probably number one. You gotta be a, a, a scumbag to stand somebody up. Fuck you, man. I'm not trying to disrespect you. Yeah, fuck you. I'm asking you. You ever been stood up, Kevin? Kevin, bro. You ever been stood up, Kev? Nah, man. N bro, you been stood up, Kev? No, man. Yes, you have. They stood you up. You went to the freaking what was it, the bowling alley? And she didn't come. Ain't that right, Kev? Speak on it, Kev. I invited her to the ball. You invited her. And what'd she do to you? What did she do to you? She ain't come, right? Say something. She she what? Speak. She had somewhere to go. She had somewhere to go. Her mom was in the hospital. Did, her mom was in the hospital. See? They be making sit up, man. Her mom was in the hospital. I had a girl tell me that she was cooking with her grandma. Your grandma? That's why you couldn't come. To, that's why you couldn't come to my crib. Your grandma, right? Well, tell your grandma I said lose my number. What you tell? What'd you tell the girl, man? What'd you tell her? What, did she? Did she let you know that she? She was in the hospital with her mom. No, she didn't. She's lying, bro. She's a snake. All these girls, is, bro. She's a snake. She's until, until after you was already there, sick, right? With your best fit on, right? You had your best fit on, right? With the yeah. with the clean sneaks on, right? Exactly. I put on, yeah. You put on your best fit and she stood him up. I'm not trying to. I went on the bus crying. You was on a bus crying, right? Talking to the crackhead on the. Yo, she put you through hell. That's number one. Y'all, y'all women is grimy. I'm not finna. I'm not taking no more prisoners. Y'all snakes. Y'all snakes, period. Y'all. <sighs> got me worked up in this John. Listen, top three. Number one, getting stood up. That's 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 dead, man. Y'all gotta stop treating people like that. Number two, hygiene. Wash it, wash up. Y'all smell like straight new pie. That's hamburger in Chinese, man. Y'all smell crazy, bro. And and, and 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 three was 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 catfish. Be you, be you. Shouldn't be trying to. You gonna ruin somebody else's. You gonna mess up somebody else's life, man. Trying to, trying to be somebody you're not. Just be you. You're going to find somebody to love you for you. 
You know what I mean? Anyway, that's it, man. I'm going to put the bloopers uh, for the freaking clip that I just showed y'all in the end of this video. Happy New Year and Merry Christmas. All right? It's the first day of 2020, and we're going to start this one off with this video right here. It's, I'm out, man. Period. No, I'm sorry, bro. Hey, man, this works out better for me anyway. The slim biddies in the summertime coming into class wearing next to nothing, and I need to be single. You're done now. It's okay to be mad. And what can I be mad for? Ain't like she just left me out there at the bus stop, which she did. I just wish I would've never wasted my money on this stupid bus card. I wish I could've done something. Hey, man, you ain't gotta do nothing, Joanne. Yeah, I shot my shot, and I got pretty damn close, didn't I? I didn't I? And I seen a green light on the gram. <laughs> I didn't was Noah, it's okay, bro. Hey, man. This works out better for me anyway. You know what I'm saying? Slim biddies in the summertime, they come into class wearing next to nothing, you feel me? It's okay to be mad, bro. But what I gotta be mad for? Ain't like she just left me out there at the bus stop, which she did. I just wish I would've never wasted my money on this stupid bus card. Bro, can you...